Nigerian president to come, and like I said, it will be the first plenary for appeal in 1946. <laughs> Our progress in affirming the fundamental right to decent housing is critical to the achievement of sustainable urbanization in terms of SDG number 11. Recognizing this imperative and realizing that more than half of Kenya's population will live in urban areas by 2050, we have integrated universal housing as a critical pillar of the national bottom-up economic transformation agenda. Into the housing program, we have further mainstreamed sustainable urban practices of green building, green spaces, adoption of low carbon energy use, including low carbon transport solutions, as well as urban agriculture and effective waste management. The governor of Nairobi informed me this morning that he made sure that all the delegates were transported on buses that, are, that do not use fossil fuels. That all the buses that were used to transport delegates here were using green energy. In addition to these measures under our urban resilience program, we are restoring degraded landscapes and ecosystems through a robust program which includes increasing Kenya's tree cover from 12% currently to 30% by planting 15 billion trees over the next 10 years. Our capacity to coherently pursue these vital objectives has been significantly bolstered by the government's policy to mainstream sustainable development goals generally, and more pertinently, number 11 on sustainable cities and communities and number 13 on climate action into national development planning and implementation. 